rodent proof cable. Fiber optic cables can be exposed to numerous hazardous conditions once installed. One such threat, no matter if the install is outdoors, aerial, underground, or in the interior of a building or home, is damage caused by gnawing rodents like mice or rats. Rodents are usually able to chew through the cable's outer sheath, potentially exposing the fibers if they are not properly protected. Any damage caused by rodents can impact the long-term reliability of the installed cables. Rodent damage to communications cables can result in interruptions to services and very costly repairs. Our task is to ensure that the cable we choose ensures this does not happen. There are several ways that we can achieve this. Any cable that needs to be rodent proof will need to be physically protected with some type of material that can stop rats and other rodents from penetrating it. The two most effective options found are a glass reinforced plastic rod armor or a metallic corrugated steel tape armor. The GRP cables use glass reinforced plastic rods to fully armor the cable and offer a robust protection needed to block rodents. This design of cable is armored by non-metallic GRP flat rods and it offers very good crush resistance and is rodent proof in that the rats can penetrate through the outer sheath but will find it difficult to penetrate through the glass reinforced armor. It also has the advantage of being non-metallic, so if an all dielectric cable is needed, it is the best option. The CST cables use corrugated steel tape and is designed for external underground installations in ducts or by direct burial. The corrugated steel tape provides the rodent protection required as they cannot penetrate through the corrugated steel armor. The armored structure also provides additional compressive strength for the actual cable. So you can use this type of optical cable when you want maximum crush resistance. Choosing a fiber optic cable for any given application requires considering several issues, installation requirements, and environmental or long-term requirements. The need to protect valuable infrastructure, reduce downtime, and any maintenance or repairs has operators looking at these alternatives to guarantee the continuous working life of any of the cables that they install.